The Hunting of Shumba by Kingsley Fairbridge. The hairs about his muzzle tipped with wet. The last sun glinting on his tawny mane and burnishing his hide. Veiled eyes that yet so slumberous solemn flash and slowly wane. Veiled slumberous solemn eyes that half asleep seem utter careless of the wild around. Soft, seeming careless steps that seek the deep gloomed bush, but give no shadow of a sound. Loose-limbed, he slouches, shambling in the cool, head down, hide rippling over lazy might. Thoughtful and terrible, he leaves the pool, Shumba the lion passing to the night. A grass blade breaking, swift in awful calm, the mighty limbs at length are on the ground, steel muscles tightening, a sense of harm, intangible, no shadow of a sound, but savage eyes unveiled, intense as death. Pursed lips and lowered ears and bated breath, dread vigour hailed from every nerve and tissue, crouching there blent with grass, incarnate, awful fear. A leap, a scream, a thud, and it is done. Silence a while and the hot smell of blood. Silence, then slowly with the sinking sun, the rend of flesh. The crickets wake and sing, the frogs take up their song, the night jars wing weird in the azure dusk. As had been willed, chance brought him food and fate has been fulfilled.